Good morning, everybody. It's Thursday, December 30th, 2021. It's about 9.30 in the morning here on the East Coast. Early, early, early this morning, around 5 a.m., I had a call with Tamara that, of course, we filmed. And, of course, because all the intel that Tamara brings us is potent, we had to put that episode on Rumble. So if you follow the link down below, you will get to the full episode with Tamara. I always have so much fun talking with her. She's one of my favorite human beings in the whole wide world. I also wanna thank you guys so much. We've gotten such positive responses from our round table that we had last night. Uh, Catherine Edwards, Medina, and myself. I had a lot of fun doing that round table and we are looking at making that more of a permanent thing, like every couple of weeks doing a round table with Catherine and Medina and myself. And so if that's something you guys would really like to see, then obviously let us know because we thoroughly enjoyed that and I've loved reading all your comments. I have read them, but I haven't had the time to respond quite yet to your comments, but I'm very, very grateful to all of you guys for leaving such positive, positive feedback. Normally on Thursdays, I do an episode with Catherine, just the two of us, but we are going to be moving that episode to either tomorrow, Friday, or Saturday, um, January 1, the New Year's Day. Since we did do that roundtable last night, we want to give it some time to kind of simmer before we do our next episode, so you can be looking out for that either tomorrow or Saturday. I'll keep you guys posted on that. Later on today, I'm going to be filming with Stephanie and Taylor, and I have all of your questions for Stephanie and Taylor, so that's going to be really fun to be able to have an episode that's focused more on you guys who submitted questions. And of course, I'm going to leave the forum open for Stephanie and Taylor to discuss any topics that they feel like they need to discuss today as we really start to ramp up in this crescendo of um, the timeline that we're on. Again, I have to be careful about what I say on YouTube. Tomorrow morning, Friday morning, 9 a.m., New Year's Eve, I will be back on Aquarius Rising Africa. Fingers crossed the internet works this time. Uh, that will be a live show, as it always is. Again, that's 9 o'clock my time on the East Coast in the morning, and that's, I believe, is like 4 o'clock their time in South Africa. We are going to be talking about where New Year's Day comes from. You guys know I'm a big old nerd, and I really like to research. That's basically what my channel is about, is me researching. So, of course, I know where New Year's Day came from, and of course, of course, there is a nefarious... Um, undertone to why we celebrate New Year's on January 1. The true New Year is actually in the spring, but we're going to get into that with uh, Shanti and Mornay on Aquarius Rising Africa tomorrow at 9 a.m. And so if you do join us for the live, you are able to type in questions and comments. Mornay does watch that while we're on the show. I can't see the questions or the comments, but Mornay is watching that. So if you want to join us there, you're, you're more than welcome to. I will probably share it to the community tab once we're done though. So if you need to watch the, the replay, you can watch the replay on the community tab. Once again, Monday, we've got a whole new Monday mystery already filmed and ready to go. And then most likely by next Friday, we'll be doing another deep dive into another New Orleans subject as we go deeper into breaking down New Orleans. Um, again, New Orleans is one of the three sisters of the South. The three sisters of the South are Charleston, Savannah, and New Orleans. I have a whole playlist on Savannah that I did a long time ago, and I have some stuff from Charleston. Charleston Charleston is more my family's hometown, and I, I haven't done as much into Charleston as I have Savannah and New Orleans, mainly because I kind of know all the stories anyway, so it's I like learning new things with you guys. Although I do have some ties to New Orleans, but most of my ancestry comes through Charleston. So that's been really fun for me as someone who's from the Deep South to be able to deep dive into these three big ports, um, and again, the three sisters of the South being Charleston, Savannah, and New Orleans. Anyway, guys, once again, thank you to all of the new patrons and producers. Something is going on with my Patreon page where it's not loading all your information. I can see that people have signed up, but it's not allowing me to like see who you are or get your contact information. And normally when I get patrons and producers, I do like to personally reach out to each of you. But if you have not received an email from me yet, that is why. There's something, there's a glitch going on with the Patreon page. You'll see when I filmed for Monday's Mystery, I addressed this as well because I can't, actually can't see your names. So I'm hoping that's just a glitch with the system. Maybe it has to do with the new um, 
money system coming in. I don't know, fingers crossed. But as soon as I'm able to actually get into my Patreon account, I will be reaching out to you guys. I don't want you guys to think I'm ignoring you. I appreciate you all so, so, so much. I mean, seriously, without you guys, we would not be able to do this channel. Even though I said in our episode with Catherine and Medina, I am not a money person and I'm really not. I'm really not a money person. Let me tell you guys, like there are girls out there that when they're looking to date men, they always like want to find a man that's got a good job. I never even thought about that when I was looking for men. I never thought about like their job or how much money they had. Probably why I always date dated poor men, but, um, but that was just never a thing for me. And so I am excited about the new, the new system that is coming in because I think that is going to take a lot of the pressure of money off of us, off of the human race. So we can actually just be humans. But as of now, as we all still have to be in this matrix of paying bills and, and, you know, buying groceries, I do very, very, very much appreciate all of the patrons because you guys are what allow me to be able to buy new equipment when I need to, or buy lights when I need to. To. And so if it wasn't for you guys, this channel would absolutely not exist. So I am so entirely grateful for everyone that's a patron. I mean, honestly, when I started this channel, I thought I was just going to be talking to myself. I didn't realize I was going to actually have people that wanted to hear this information. And I started this channel because my shala got shut down by the lockdown. And so it became something for me to do when I had nothing to do because I couldn't leave my house like most of you guys during that time. And I'm still just flabbergasted that people actually want to listen to me rambling on about interesting research that I've found. So I, and then the fact that you guys are actually signing up to patrons and producers is just mind blowing to me. And I, I appreciate you all so, so, so much. And I cannot wait absolutely cannot wait for the day to come where I can actually meet all of you guys in person and hang out with you and give you all great big hugs because I mean it when I say it you guys are all all a part of this channel as well it's not just me esoteric Atlanta would not exist if it wasn't for all you guys watching right now and I mean that from the bottom of my heart um, I humbly humbly am so grateful for all of you so thank you thank you so 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 much and again for the patrons and producers I will be reaching out to you as soon as I'm able to access your email addresses. So, so just hold on for that. Fingers crossed that glitch will be fixed very soon. All right, guys. Again, if you want to watch the full episode with Tamara, I highly suggest you do because we had a lot of fun this morning. There is a link down in the description box below. Just click on it and it'll take you directly to the episode on Rumble. I hope that you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful day ahead of you. Keep your head held high. Remember remember how special you are, how protected you are. And as it says in the book of Esther, perhaps you were born for such a time as this. All right, guys. God bless. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.